असलम डियर स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू एपसेक्स ऑनलाइन स्पोर्ट प्रोग्राम्स योर फोर्थ वीक असाइनमेंट्स आर्टिफिशियल इंटेलिजेंस एंड यार योर कंप्यूटर टीचर रूबीना इश्तिया द टॉपिक इज फिफ्थ जनरेशन स्टार्टेड फ्राम नाइनटीन नाइनटीन टू ऑनवर्ड द आर्टिफिशियल इंटेलिजेंस एक्चुअली स्टूडेंट्स इन द नाइनटीन नाइन्टीज कंप्यूटर बिकम्स इवन फास्टर एंड प्रजेंटेड द अपॉर्चुनिटी टू डिवेलप आर्टिफिशियल इंटेलिजेंस सिस्टम This is intelligent, which is exhibited by machines or software. Robotics developed in order to build machine that can think or resembles humans, leading us to fifth generation computer. AI, the artificial intelligence. A question rises in your mind: the what is the artificial intelligence? So, artificial intelligence is the science and engineering of making intelligent machine. So, the introductions claiming to be able to recreate the capabilities of the human mind in both a challenge and an inspiration for philosophy. it is the science and engineering of making intelligent machines especially intelligent computer programs development in new areas in the fifth generation vlsi technology becomes ulsi vlsi means very large scale integration and this technology were used in third and fourth generation of computers and ulsi the ultra large scale integrations technology it's used in fifth generation the ai resulting in the product of microprocessor chips having 10 millions electronic components this generation is based on parallel processing hardware and ai the artificial intelligence software Actually, students, the Asimo, the human robots built by the company Honda in 2000, it, it was attempt to combine the artificial intelligence and the robotics. The applications of AI intelligence, natural language understanding, expert system, planning and robotics, machine learning, game playing. here are the fields of artificial intelligence the computer science the graphical user interface automatic storage management object oriented programming data mining computer gaming and the in used in telecommunications automated online assistants voice dialing and speech recording aviations and automations nasa flight research centers voice recognitions in fighter jet directions to ai pilots through air traffic controllers and automatic gearing systems in car and another field of artificial intelligence where they use in robotics assembling robots welding robots behavior based robots dancing robots and robot navigation Here are the some basic aims of fifth generation computing. Scientists are constantly making progress in several directions. Some the scientists are researching how to create the different types of computers that they will not based on transistors but on other physical principles such as quantum machines. or a biological principles dna computers they hope these computers will be able to process a huge amount of data in fifth generation computers these are the more reliable works faster easily portable different size different features different affordable price extra high processing speed parallel processing and wireless in fifth generation computer fifth generation computing based on artificial intelligence are still in development 
through there are some applications such as voice recognitions that are being used today the use of parallel processing and superconductor is helping to make the artificial intelligence a reality quantum computers the super large scale integrated chips are used artificial intelligence and recognitions of image and graphics here are the some examples of fifth generations of computer the development of fifth generations of computer from home pc to laptop and in the smartphone actually the smartphones nowadays are like small computers of course we can always call from our friends our grandmothers fathers but we know also browse the internet send and receive emails chats with the friends and play group laptop computers are portable PCs that we can carry almost anywhere we want because they are small, light and they use a battery. So students, here are some drawbacks of artificial intelligence. Limited ability, slow layer time, response, can't handle emergency situations and difficult code high cost so student it's the end of the topic hope so you will be able to explain more about the fifth generation of computer thank you allah hafiz